There are a few different theories on why we procrastinate. One is that we're perfectionists and don't want to start something unless we know we can do it perfectly. Another is that we're afraid of failure. But whatever the reason, procrastination is something we all can overcome with a little bit of effort. We have compiled a four-step process for you to help overcome procrastination. Step number one, recognize. The first step to getting over procrastination is to recognize it. Once you identify that you are procrastinating, you must be able to take steps to overcome it. Some helpful tips to overcome procrastination include 1. Split down your job into smaller, more manageable tasks. 2. Setting realistic goals and deadlines. 3. Prioritizing tasks. 4. Creating a positive and motivating environment for yourself. 5. Practicing self-compassion. If you struggle with procrastination, remember that you are not alone. There are many resources and strategies available to help you overcome this obstacle. Step number two, understand. The second step to getting over procrastination is understanding why you do it. People procrastinate for many reasons, but understanding why you do it is essential in overcoming the habit. Some common reasons for procrastination include fear of failure, perfectionism, lack of motivation, and disorganization. If you can identify the reason or reasons why you tend to procrastinate, you can develop a plan to address the issue. Step number three, plan. The third step to getting over procrastination is to make a plan. We must sit down and figure out what needs to be done, when, and how to do it. Once you do, stick to your plan and keep yourself from getting sidetracked. Step number four, action. The fourth step to getting over procrastination is to take action. This means you must start doing something instead of just thinking about it. Once you start taking action, you will find it easier to keep going and avoid procrastinating in the future. Final thoughts. The best way to beat procrastination is to set small, realistic goals for yourself. Keep in mind that everyone procrastinates and don't be too hard on yourself when you do. Think of procrastination as a sign that you need to change something, like a change of scenery, a new project, or a new approach. If you need help, there are many ways to get it. Watching this video is an example of getting help. Make sure to take follow-up actions to get the full benefit. Do these steps help? Do you think you can overcome procrastination? If you have used something different that has helped, please let us know in the comments below. Thank you.